In this video, I'm going to show you an exercise that is going to reduce the number of shoulder injuries that you get as a boxer. Shoulder injuries for boxers are commonplace, but we can use prehabilitation of the shoulder and specifically of the rotator cuff tendon to reduce these to allow you more time to do your boxing. Hi, I'm Andy Wake, head coach at Boxer Size. Over 29 years, I've taken 1,100 Boxer Size courses, training over 18,000 people to do Boxer Size myself, and been responsible for the development of 28,000. This is our YouTube channel. I hope you like it. This exercise is going to involve the rotator cuff tendon, which is here in all three exercises, using the posterior, the rear deltoid, the lateral deltoid, the middle deltoid, and the anterior deltoid here, the front deltoid. You can use a band, you don't need handles like this, but that's what I've got. You can use a normal band on its own. This one is rated at 35 pounds, so it's very strong. But if you're rehabilitating, you may start with a band as light as 10 pounds. So choose a band according to whatever, whatever suits you. The first part of the movement, posterior deltoid, pull back, Hold for five seconds. Elbows and shoulders level. Rotate backwards, a lateral deltoid. Then push up like this. Anterior deltoid. Hold for five. Down, hold for five. Rotate, hold for five. In. There we go. Back, two, three, four, five. Rotate, two, three, four, five. Press two, three, four, five. Down two, three, four, five. Rotate two, three, four, five. Forward two, three, four, five. That is one repetition. Start with 10 repetitions, build up to 20 repetitions, and that is going to prehabilitate your shoulders and reduce the injuries that you are likely to have as a boxer. Okay. Again, from the side, back, two three four five rotate two three four five press two three four five down two three four five rotate two three four five forwards two three four five as a bonus i'll also show you one of my favorite warm-ups for weight training which is using the shoulders now this just involves using suspension trainer I've got this at a sensible angle, a little bit above my head height here, and you can alter the resistance by lengthening or shortening the straps and by your foot position. I'll show you these exercises first. So I stand at an angle here like this, and then what I do, this is a good angle for me, but you might find that you prefer a more upright angle, which would reduce the load. What I do then is I pull back like this, I do six to eight of these, then I pull sideways until my chest comes level with the hands like this, and then I pull here like this. So I do six of these, six of these, under control, six of these, squeezing the shoulder blades together. I find that's a particularly good warm up for the shoulder muscles. That's a really good thing to do as part of your strength training or as a warm-up for your weight training. 